So LeBron James just signed a four-year, $145 million deal to go over to the Lakers. Now, I don't know about you, but to me, this really doesn't have an immediate impact on my direct life. And the reason for that is because I'm not LeBron James. I don't own the Lakers. I don't have an investment in the Lakers. And most likely, you don't either. So if right now you're watching this and you're just like, how can someone make that much money for abandoning their home team? Well, the reason is the amount of ticket sales that LeBron's going to bring to the Lakers, you know, Kobe's gone, and I haven't been following basketball too much, but Kobe's gone. He was an easy person to get people into seats, which increases ticket sales, which increases revenue at the concession stands, which increases, you know, jersey sales, all the other memorabilia. So now LeBron's going to be able to do that. That is why he is getting $145 million for only four years. Now, if this is frustrating to you, the good news is there's something you can do about it. And that is start your own business. You're going to you know, have to put in a ton of time. What most people don't see is the time that LeBron was like five or six years old until the time that he was like 25, 30, how old is he now? He is 33. So this whole time, Malcolm Gladwell talks about like the 10,000 hours. LeBron's done that. He's probably done like 100,000 hours, 200,000 hours. And that's the reason that he's the best player in the NBA right now is because he's put in the time. The same exact thing is true of growing a business and especially when it comes to online marketing and advertising. You need to put in the time. You need to create, you know, everything from videos. You need to drive, you need basically three separate things. You need a website, a traffic source, and a way to convert people into paying customers. And the benefit that you have right now is that you don't have a huge following, so you you know you don't piss off immediately all of the fans that are in Cleveland. I don't know if the people in Miami are still mad about him leaving, but you won't be you know making a bunch of people mad by deciding to start your own business or to grow your own business from where it's at now into something more significant. And I actually want to invite you to my social media marketing for entrepreneurs group that's over on Facebook where I share a bunch of tips, tricks, action steps that you can use to grow your business so that you can, you know, quit complaining about LeBron James making a bunch of money and actually start making money for yourself. All right, so right now you're probably like, okay, yeah, sure. You can build a business, I get it. So right now I'm actually gonna take you into my computer and show you step by step what you need to start doing in order to build a business that can create an income that's gonna change your life. Okay, so now if what you're wondering is how do you actually build one of these online businesses? Well, there's a couple things you're gonna need, like I mentioned, and the first one's going to be, whoops, we're gonna delete that. First one's gonna be a website, and I'll actually show you where to get this later on. So you're gonna need a website, you're gonna need traffic, and basically traffic is just people. It's just uh, you know visitors, people who are real people, and you're gonna need conversions. And conversions is just sales. My MacBook writing ability is not the best, but you get the idea. So you can start to see the three things you actually need to create a business online. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna need to come up with you know, of course, an idea, you need to pick a niche and provide a solution to a problem. And the best way to do this is to think about things in your life that are problems, things that, you know, if you had a solution to it, it would make your life so much easier. And after that, you're going to create a website. Oh my God, that looks like a, a baseball thing, doesn't it? Okay, so this is a box. So this is going to be the website. And what happens is your website will educate people. It'll basically teach people how to overcome the issue that they have. The next thing is traffic. So think about like when you're on Instagram and you're watching someone's story and one of those girls tells you to swipe up to buy like the outfit or makeup or something. That is traffic. Every time an individual person clicks through to a website, that's considered traffic. So what you're going to do is your website is going to be based around education and sales. So what's going to happen is traffic is going to go to the website. Whoops. We'll do uh so we'll do like this is, this can be like Facebook posts. This can be Instagram. 
And it's basically just anywhere that there's individual people who are able to watch and consume your content and click through to something. Like right now you're on YouTube, so there's another traffic source. So basically you need to have this website set up and established so that you can collect leads and leads are basically just people who are interested in your product or service or people who want to claim something that solves their problem. After that, so you see all the traffic, it goes to the website, you're going to need to get like name and email and then these little boxes and I'll actually give you a 14 day trial to the software I use at the end of this video if you keep watching. But after that, you'll be able to collect people's email information. Then the next step, what do you do? Well, you sell them something. That's where the conversions come in. So let's say that, can I move this a little? I don't know how to move this thing. Okay, that's not gonna work. But the idea here is your, ooh. So the website here is gonna sell something. This is a sales funnel. And what happens with the thing that I'm gonna actually show you is let me see if I'm still drawing. Okay, so you can sell something. Let's say you're providing someone with fitness advice. Someone's interested in like the keto diet or something. Right now the keto diet is extremely hot, so a lot of people are pushing traffic to it. Traffic, like I mentioned earlier, Instagram, Facebook, YouTube. Just people, just people's eyeballs. Uh, this can be come from pretty much anywhere. But you're going to give someone like a free report. So for keto, you can have like the seven foods that you didn't know that were keto that are slowly killing you or something like that. Like get something that solves someone's problems. Ideally you could do like a 30 day recipe guide for going keto. And on that, what you do is that's just absolutely free. You get someone's email. So we'll put a little email here and that's where email marketing comes in. I'll talk about that in a couple minutes here, but You'll see here email, and then this is the thank you page. So on the thank you page, you'll deliver the product. So like, let's say this is like a little PDF guide you, you wrote or you had someone write. You can pay people to do all this stuff for you too, which is incredible. So you can give, give away like a nice report that educates people, gives people a 30-day keto action diet plan. And then underneath it, what you want to do is like in a, if it's a video, you can say, I actually got a deal on a keto product that I highly recommend picking up. And you just have a little buy button. And what happens is, you know, this will be the thank you page. So you're giving people value. You're educating them about the diet. You're giving them the 30 day recipe guide. And then after you can, you know, send them to a buying thing. And what that can be pretty much anything. It can be, uh, you can go on to clickbank.com. And there's products that are like fitness related and you can sell those. If you have uh, physical products, you can do CPA offers, which are basically uh, companies pay you for sales, um, which is just like affiliate marketing. Or you can sell your own products. You can sell like a workout class if you yourself are doing it. Workout class, workout guides. And this is stuff that you'll, of course, want to test as you do this. As your business grows, you'll want to test out all the different things. But this is just, like I said, like an introduction to it. Oh, I figured that out. Cool. Um, okay, so can I draw again? Yeah. So as you saw, like website traffic conversions. So this is website right here, traffic right here, conversions right here. So this is exactly how you can start making money. The thing is... Once you start creating your own products, what you can do is, you know, you can take people from your website to, let's say this is a, you know, you do a three day video series, make this look like a little video. So this is day one. And what this is doing is this is just like providing massive value to someone, like providing solutions to people's problems. These video, these pictures are terrible. I hope you're still watching this. <laughs> but so you can see here, this is like a, each day. Is that going to show up? Yes. Yeah, so this is day one. They get one video that educates them. And you'll want to link up to like they can buy something. Day two, the same thing. Buy... Day three, same idea, buy. And you can even, on this, what, here we go, we'll scroll down a little. 
So for people buying stuff, what that can mean is you can create your own course. So you can sell, you know, day one watches this video, day two watches this video, day three watches this video, and on day four, you can sell them your course, your product. You can say like, you have a 30 day weight loss course and it's based around the keto diet. So you can say you'll charge like 47 bucks for that. And this is just examples, like you'll, you'll test prices and you'll have to learn a lot more about all of this, but this is just the outline, this is how this works. So $47 and then let's say you do, you know, if they don't buy that, you can offer something else for like 27 bucks. And the tool that I mentioned earlier is ClickFunnels. You'll get the 14 day trial for that. You can set this all up and make it work. So if someone doesn't buy something on the first thing, you can send them to another site, which is basically just like a sales funnel. So it's if someone doesn't buy something for $50, or in this case, 47, you offer them something similar. You know, it's not the full product or full service or whatever, but it's half the price just to turn them into a customer. The same thing happens with someone who does buy something. Like let's say you have the $47 course goes for you know, 30 days or something or 90 days. And what you can do is you can upsell them, upsell and upsell is basically, it's like, it's kind of like when you go into McDonald's, if you go to McDonald's and you order something and they say, oh, would you like fries with that? That's an upsell. That's a way to get more revenue from one individual person. Okay, so on the upsell, what you can do is you can say like, we're doing a $200 like group coaching, coaching. And this can be done on like a Facebook group or, you know, you can set up a membership site. It looks like couching, but you get the idea of coaching. And if you still want to, you know, add more upsells, what you can do is you can do like individual coaching, you do like personal training stuff. And with all of this, like, if you personally are fat and out of shape, you can hire someone to do the everything for you. Like you can hire a personal trainer and then, you know, you'll need a video person and someone to deliver the content and all that, but you can have a personal trainer do that for you. You know, you can pay them a thousand dollars a month to create five videos a week or, you know, you'll have to come up with like an agreement and stuff for them. But this is just like, spitting out ideas so that you can understand how these types of businesses work. Okay, so after that, you could do like one-on-one -on -one something where it's like a $1,000. And this could be like one-on-one, -on -one, just like with basketball, one-on-one. -on -one. You get a lot more detail. It's a lot you know, more work for you or the person that you hire, but it's a higher value for the person who's buying. And I mentioned earlier that email marketing comes in and email marketing is basically just a consistent way to send traffic to your content. So I'm going to show you, this is going to be the email marketing segment. So this will be day one. This will be day two. This will be day three. And then this can go on forever. Like this can be 14 million days of content. But what happens is, so someone signs up, you get their email, they enter your little email follow-up section. Day one, you send them to the day one video. Day two, send them to the day two video. Day three, send them to the day three video. And then guess what? Once you have this person's info, you can continuously send them through your sales funnel, so through this section, to close people, to turn them into paying customers. Guess what? With email marketing, you get number five, you get day six, and every single day, you know, you, you don't have to email every day. You can, it helps. Or you can set up a autoresponder and that's what email marketing is, just an autoresponder. And I recommend getting Market Hero for that. I'll link that up down below. Um, but this is just like an overall outline of how this entire business process works. So now you understand how people are able to create income from internet marketing. And you can do this yourself. Like it doesn't need to be a fitness product. It can be anything. It can be related to any industry. You just need to find a way to solve someone's problems and then provide solutions and products that you know fully you know, solve the problems for people. And after that, it's just consistently sending traffic. Like look at this, it just all starts with traffic websites and then conversions 
you'll need to do testing of each of these. You know, certain traffic sources are going to be warmer or colder based on where they are in the buying cycle, but that's all stuff that you need to think about later on when you're optimizing everything. And that's where actual, you know, getting coaches and getting a full handheld help comes into play. But that's it for this video. What I want you to do next is to sign up for my Social Media Marketing for Entrepreneurs Facebook group. You're gonna get more trainings and coachings just like this so you can understand how to build a successful business based on you know, data, like using numbers to make sure things make sense for you and then creating a business that funds your dream lifestyle. Thanks for watching. Sign up for that group down below.